Hello OG, I'm Ruth Mantilla Manatad. And I'm Ayan Noel Manatad. Tara, samahan nyo kami at mag-relax tayo sa farmhouse namin dito sa Leyte. So before I give you a tour of the house, this lot is actually owned by my parents and we call it Mioy's Farm. The lot is a 2.8 hectare lot and our house is a 35 square meter house. This house is built on a concrete foundation and we added wood accents which are Jimelina and Santol and we got these wood from Typhoon Odette. This is our porch. This is where we usually receive our guests kung may mga bisita kami. And this is our main door. This wall, I really wanted to use the PVC wall panels. Kaya lang, it's very out of the budget namin. So, I've looked for cheaper ways to achieve the look that I wanted. And we used one by one S4S wood and nailed it to the concrete wall. And this is where we use our Jimelina wood. I was born and raised in Cebu City, and my husband is born and raised in Maramag Bukidnon. And before we got married, I really wanted to have our prenup shoot dito sa farm ng parents ko. And the first time he got here, he fell in love, and he got the idea to move here and build our own house. Growing up, yung dream house ko, actually the same kami ng husband ko. We both wanted a simple, tiny house, specifically located sa province. Yung walang traffic, yung tahimik lang, and parang stress-free. So this is our dining area. This table is made of tugas wood. This is where we usually eat or do work since we have direct lighting. Since most of the areas in the house are indirect lighting. And these chairs, I got it from a second-hand item store in Cebu. I really love its imperfections. And in terms of durability, it's still very durable. And this is our living room. I designed it as a sunken living room to have a high ceiling effect. This is where we usually relax after work, watch TV, and just enjoy the view. So this is our kitchen. We have here our fridge, our tiny sink, and our filtered water that we use for drinking, and our coffee maker, other appliances, and our stove. For the overall design of the house, we were actually inspired by adding wood pieces in the interior and the exterior parts of the house. We used Santol wood on our floor on top of a concrete slab and we also used it as shelves in our kitchen. And we used Jemelina wood for our door and our hanging workstation table. For the exterior of the house, I added breeze blocks to have a classic look and at the same time having natural ventilation inside the house. What makes this farmhouse a home is actually the people around us, especially our parents who live nearby. And on weekdays, we have people coming in and help us in the farm. And on weekends, we have our family who visit us. So dito naman, I personally painted these walls using Asvesti Lime Wash paint to have accent walls and to break the monotony of the overall white scheme of the house. So this is our mini workstation. This is where we actually use the Jimelina wood for a table and this is where we store our personal stuff like our books, our toy car collection and for the shelves, it's still Jimelina wood. We started planning last February 2022 and the construction started on March 28th and completed on September 30, 2022. So the overall construction lasted for six months. The open space below was not originally part of the plan because we wanted to have our house elevated. Uh, during 
the actual construction of the house. That's where we realized na slopey talaga yung site and we got the idea to have an outdoor living space. For the windows, we use jealousy windows. So this is for us to maximize the wind coming inside, natural ventilation and natural lighting as well. So one of the advantages of using jealousy windows is that when it rains, you can tilt it to an angle para hindi pumapasok yung ulan. And at the same time, may hangin pa din na pumapasok so hindi mainit sa loob ng bahay. And we planned it talaga to have it from floor to ceiling height to make the space feel and look bigger. This is our bathroom. So we have here a lavatory, our water closet, and we purposely have this niche for us to have more storage. And still, we use jealousy windows for natural ventilation. And we soon plan to install blinds for us to have more privacy, but as of now, we don't need it since wala namang tao sa labas and it's the back portion of the farm. And here we have our shower area. So lahat ng fixtures namin dito sa bahay ay all black like our shower, our faucets, and bidets, switches, and outlets to have a classic look. For the lot, our parents gave this to us for free. They gave us the freedom to choose where to build our house around the farm. For the construction of the house, it's roughly around 30 to 35,000 per square meter. For the overall estimated price of the house, nasa 1.1 million, excluding the wood from the debris of Typhoon Odette. So this is our bedroom. So we have it designed na kakasya lang talaga yung king sized bed namin. And here we have our bay window. So this is actually my husband's idea for us to have more storage and space and we can actually use it as a working table. And as you can see, wala kayong makikita na closets. It's because we maximize the space underneath our bed. So and dito yung mga things na ginagamit namin every day, like our clothes. And and dito naman yung mga gamit na hindi namin ginagamit every day, like our bed sheets, pillowcases, and other things. So this is actually my, my four months idea. He made these keys para ma open natin yung storage. So this is our deck. This is one of our favorite spots here in the house. And we have here our chair. This is actually my spot. This is my corner and our plants, our hanging shelves. And this is where we spend our night stargazing, chilling, and enjoy the view of the farm. Thank you sa pagsama sa amin today dito sa aming farmhouse tour. Sana na-inspire namin kayo sa aming story and malay nyo, baka kayo din magkaroon ng sarili nyong farmhouse. Bye! Want to share your house and get featured? Email us at stories.onlygood at gmail.com and tell us about your interesting home story. For more videos like this, subscribe to OG and be part of the community.